Hey guys, as you know, they have changed the talent on the Dr. Home. So this is the talent on the Dr. Home. Okay. So shooting an enemy with this weapon will apply a mark for five seconds. If a mark target is killed, it will drop a 10% armor repair kit, which applies to the whole party when picked up. The kit will not give bonus armor. So before it used to be 15%, now it's 10% and everyone can pick it up now instead of just you. And also perfect focus works on works on the doctor home now, which is which is finally they actually did that change because I thought the doctor home was a pretty pretty good gun apart from the talent being useless. But also I've noticed this. I'm not too sure if it was supposed to be this way, or if the of or if they forgot to reword the talent. I'll show you the two clips um, later on. Uh, one's in the shooting range and one's in actual gameplay so it says here shooting an mu so it says here if a marked target is killed it will drop a 10 percent armor repair kit but i've noticed that it's not dropping any repair kits whatsoever okay and which applies to the whole party team when picked up so i've noticed is when i marked someone for five seconds right and i killed that marked enemy and say my teammate's armor is um, down and my armor is down. When I kill that that, to uh, that marked enemy, I get the 10% armor and my teammates get the 10% armor without picking anything up. Nothing drops on the floor. So you can kill someone from distance that's marked and you're basically healing your team without going in to pick anything up. It's I'll show I'll show you the clips. It's it's weird. So if your whole team ran this on a DPS build, you're basically just constantly healing each other. I, I, I don't know if it's broken or not. Just take a take a look at the clips I recorded. There's not going to be any voice voiceover on them. Just just watch them. You'll see. And um, no no repair kits uh, drop at all, which is which is kind of uh, kind of weird. And you're basically he your all your whole team is getting that ten percent armor. If all obviously if your team has to be down on armor, but when you get a kill, that's an uh, enemy that's marked with the doctor home. You're repairing yourself and your team. There's nothing to pick up. You don't have to run into battle to pick it up. So please let me know if this is uh, if this is intended that way. But I mean, if if they left the doctor home that way, then I think a lot more people will use it, and the talent won't be useless like it was before. But anyways. Uh, this is the build that I will show you. So this is, um, I'll show legendary gameplay after this as well. And I'll show those two clips. Okay. Uh, they'll be in the, in the timestamp on the video. So I'm using the doctor home. Okay. I'm using that FAMAS with damage target cover and fast hands. And I have the CQB SS scope and 30% hatchet damage on there. Uh, critical hit chance, critical hit chance and the 20 rounds. So these are the two main guns I'll be using. On the build, I'll be using three pieces of Providence. So I get 15% headshot damage, 10% crit chance damage, and 15% crit chance, uh, crit hit damage. And everything on the build is rolled weapon damage, crit damage, crit chance with a crit damage gear mod. All right. So this is pretty much your generic high end build. And then my chest piece is the air holding named chest piece called the pristine example. Okay. So in here, I have the same attributes, same core. And I have a talent called Perfect Focus. So before the before uh, the recent so before this season, the Perfect Focus did not work on the Doctor Home, and now it actually does. So you can actually use it because it does when you aim in, it does have a scope. So Perfect Focus increases total weapon damage by six percent every second you are aiming while scoped eight times or higher, up to sixty percent. Okay, so that is a lot of extra weapon damage. All right, and then my next two pieces is the contractor's glove. So you have damage to armor and have crit damage rolled onto there. And then I have the name the Fox's Prayers knee pads because they give you damage target of cover and crit damage rolled onto there. And my skills is the Crusader Shield and the Reviver Hive. Okay, so I'll show you my stats. So I have 44% crit chance and 185 crit damage on the Doctor Home. Okay, and on the FAMAS, I have 54 crit chance and 168 crit damage. Okay, so I'm using the sharp sharpshooter specialization because it helps me with my aim. You can use gunner, uh, whatever you feel like using, it's completely up to you. 
So this actually gives me 15% increased headshot damage with rifles and marksman rifles. Allows for precision aim. And you also get 15% increased weapon stability, reduced recoil, and faster requisition of targets. Because both my guns have a scope, I have a scope on the Dr. Home, I have a scope on the FAMAS, I'm able to aim much better with the sharpshooter. And because we're running the Dr. Home and it gives us uh, armor kits, so we have some survivability as well for us and for our party members. Alright, so I'll show you the DPS on the Dr. Home. It's really weird. I, I'm not too sure if it's broken or not. So let's change this to... I hope it shows the numbers uh, well because um, I've not been... I've been having really bad internet recently. Okay, so... Can you see focus stacks? All right. So I want to see, so I fully stack, let's see the damage numbers. Okay. So I'm hitting 2.5, 800k. So that's pretty much the, the DPS numbers. Pretty nice DPS numbers. And the Doctor Home is actually a really nice gun when you're shooting with it. It feels very comfortable, honestly. I actually really like the gun. It does a lot of damage. Okay, and for the Assault Rifle, for the FAMAS, here are the damage numbers. Not too bad. It's still pretty good. We're still hitting uh, hit, hitting quite high numbers. Okay. I hope it worked this time. So I'm going to damage myself. So I did it in the shooting range. All right. For the first testing. And I noticed that when I was playing legendary. That when I was killing people. I was getting armor kits. And I noticed my teammates armor. And they were also getting the 10%. I tested it in the shooting range and I was wondering because I was in the shooting range that it drops over there that I'm unable to pick it up so I automatically pick it up myself like it goes towards your armor because it's unaccessible so I went out um, into the open world of course and tested out with my friend so I told him to shoot um, someone and kill someone and I'll take a little bit of damage and it, it gave him, when he killed that person with his doctor home, it gave him 10% and it gave me 10% without picking anything up. So, yeah, so I'll show you now. So I've damaged myself. See, can you see I'm, I'm, I'm basically getting armor back? Yeah, so that's pretty much it. You can, if you ran, if you ran gunner, you'd be able to give yourself a lot of, um... A lot of armor back actually which is pretty useful so you could technically run a gunner specialization instead of the sharpshooter but yeah guys i just wanted to show you that just um let me know in the comment section uh what you think of the talent is it broken do you think they should leave it honestly i think they should leave it i i i really like it that way instead of you know having to run in someone on tank build having to run in to pick it up to uh repair everyone's armor i i don't really like that it's nice when you can shoot people from distance and use it on a dps build and heal your whole team it's pretty cool anyways guys please like this video and subscribe to the channel if you want to check out my other um check out my division 2 playlist so i've got a bunch of builds there if you want to check it out i like to play legendary mainly and do legendary builds um if you want i can also do heroic builds but i'm not really bothered about heroic content honestly Anyways, guys, take it easy, have a great weekend, and peace.
objective. Don't let anything stand in your way.
assistance needed. Trauma detected. 